program for today is I'm gonna go to the Reading Festival. I talk with a fitness YouTuber called Mo Samuels. Check him out. He's a pretty cool dude. And I think I'm just gonna go with his crew because my friends are staying over here. Uh, I'm not gonna get a haircut because I think it looks uh, horrible. And then buy some food, come back, maybe have an hour of sleep and then meet the guys uh, in the entrance of the festival. Oh yeah, and they printed some tickets, so we're gonna sort of sneak in, I guess. But I'm not sure if we can get in, but I trust the guys. I think they gonna make a proper job, so let's see what happens. All right, so the queue in the barber was way too, way too long. So I'm just gonna do the shopping and I don't know, I will see after that. Uh, maybe I go back, uh, maybe not. Maybe I just leave out the haircut and like go straight away home, uh, eat, uh, get my shit together and just go straight away to the riding festival. So we got the food. Hello. It's probably, it was really unnecessary to carry this. What is it? Well, it's like, a, it's a stance. Yeah, I no, I don't have that. Nah, I like way too many cards already, <laughs> to be honest. Seems like my hair stays for a while, so yeah, I will see what I can do with it. Half an hour nap. Uh, I really love napping. Uh, it just ch charged back my battery. It's... Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, let's go. I managed to do something with my hair. I, don't know if, I think it looks. Pretty, I don't know, like weird, but it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. You guys go in and have a great party, live that six life, uh, meet some new people, uh, get some new boss, and pretty much that's it. We are waiting for an hour for Mo to pick up us. Uh, I think he got stuck in the traffic. It's freezing. Yeah, I've already missed Fallout Boys, but there could be like, some like decent artists. So it turned out we have to walk another 40 minutes uh, until we get where we want to. And I'm pretty sure we're gonna go in. We're not gonna give up this easily. We managed to sneak in. I'm like I'm hoping that I can, I can get in tomorrow. Ah, <laughs> uh, you are carrying Magnesia to the festival, so you can like nah, deadlift if you want HMB, to. HMB, bro. What? HMB. What's that? Like uh, similar to creatine. Muscle protein synthesis, yeah. Tastes so horrible. <laughs> right, we gotta put this tent up. Literally, all we did is just like, waiting for like two and a half hours, get a band, uh, come in, uh, meet the guys, uh, have them set up the tent, and then we went to a silent disco, where we were like a pretty huge lane. Uh, and then that was it, like, it's like super chilling over here. Uh, there's no more party, only that one. We have to wait at least like an hour to get in. So it was like, it made like no sense to go in. And now we're gonna head back home and just like try to get some sleep. And we're gonna come back tomorrow and Sunday as well. But hopefully tomorrow gonna be better. So yeah, we will see. Yes, my God. <laughs> So we've tried to fake wristbands on the night of the first day and it was working. So all left is to get dressed and repeat the process in daylight. Where is everyone? Me and Balint just about to go to the Reading Festival. As you can see, Balint is super excited about today's event. But we got Tonchi as well. Say hi to the audience. But before that, I'm gonna have a haircut. That's cool, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we are about to sneak into Reading Festival. Uh, we got a fake band, but well, I think we can make it. We just have to like act really normal and confident when passing the gates, and I think it's gonna be alright. I think we're gonna check in from the festival. It's gonna be Alan Walker, Dualipa is playing right now, and that's Kai. So the plan is yeah, Coke over here. That looks like just a normal Coke, and I wanna carry this, so I'm not gonna put this in the bag, but like I'm just gonna grab it in my hand with the hand that I have the bands on. So what I'm gonna do is just like act super normal and like lift up the Coke like it's just a normal Coke to check my band meanwhile at the same time. It's gonna be like a double bluff. And yeah, well we are over here. I'm not the best signs, but yeah, we will see. Well, not the best company to walk with as you are trying to sneak into one of the biggest festivals in the UK using fake wristbands. Well, this was literally way too easy. Uh, it's like looking if there are like any security behind me. But 
yeah, it was like pretty cool. And Sunday was supposed to be our best day. The whole crew was together, great lineup, we got Go. proper drunk. Nothing could stop us from having the party of our life. Yeah, except try one it, thing. Try it, try it, we completely try it. forget about our fake wristbands, but the security called us, carried to a tent, asked a bunch of questions, then kicked us out. <laughs> Yo, I just wanted to sneak in my friends to the festival, but we got like pretty unlucky, so we came home and now I'm gonna have a haircut from David on booze. <laughs> well, I wanted to have a haircut anyway, so now was the right time. Are you drinking? I don't know, but it tastes like alcohol. How the fuck does this work? Like that. It doesn't cut anything. Go, go with like one centimeter and don't use that brush. Now give it to me. Okay. Is it cutting it? <laughs> there is no way back now. <laughs> make, make sure don't cut it like that high, I guess. Whoa, it's good, bro. It's not, it's not bad. So this video should be like what not to do when you're drunk really? and you didn't get to the festival well like i mean like because, that, you, like, because you bought fake well, tickets on gumtree sneaked in two times and the third time i wanted to go in they said it's a fake ticket but i was like i've already been <laughs> i've already been inside like two times i just cut it out i control what's gonna be in the video or what's not <laughs> Don't move. I want. I need to piss. Uh, don't move. Uh, Whoa, it's quite cool, bro. No. <laughs> Go look at yourself. <laughs> Thank you. It looks amazing. You see it? The hunger guy gonna win. Come on, David. 